Gary, that's the team's first pre-season week under the belt. How are you feeling after it? No, listen, it's great. The um, Great being back, back amongst the lads. Obviously, we've got a lot of new faces. Any pre-season's hard, you know, um, and every manager's got their own way of doing it. I've got a certain way that I like to do it. The players seem to be enjoying it. They're working hard. You know, we've had various people missing a session here or there, maybe holidays that they had booked before they came to the club, stuff like that. So we've not yet had a full squad all training together. But the lads that have been here, I think that's six sessions. We've done now two doubles on the Saturdays, a, sing a single Tuesday, a single Thursday. So six sessions and i um, quite happy with how the lads have came back, the shape that they're in and how and their fitness level so far. You've kept the core of your squad from last season. How important is that to keep the consistency going into next season? I think it's important that some of the players that were already here last season know how myself and Brown want to work, how we want to train, the standards that we're trying to set the club. I think that helps to integrate the new players in to know what's expected of them on and off the pitch. Um, so I think it was important that we did keep our core. And listen, the lads that we had to move on, it's unfortunate you know, they all done well for the club, they done well for me and Brown when we came in. But sometimes in football you just need to change your squad up a little bit. It wasn't so much a something that they had done in particular. I just felt that we needed to try and get a little bit of freshness into the squad, and that's what we've tried to do. You know, we've brought in, I think it's seven, and I th still think we need to probably add another three players to the squad. Mm. We're actively trying to do that, but just now it's proven a little bit more difficult. Um, so we've got to be patient. We've got to make sure we don't just bring in players for the sake of bringing it in. We've got to be the right quality. We've got to try and improve the team, improve the squad. So we'll be patient and uh, hopefully in the next couple of weeks we'll get another two or three bodies added. Absolutely. You've got your first bounce game next week. Uh, how close are you to having your final squad? Yeah, well, as I say, we want to run with about a squad of 18 or 19 players. We've got 15 signed just now, so you say we're three or four away. I don't really like running with a squad bigger than that because, you know, players are part-time. They come in, they work during the week, they come into train, they get to a Saturday, you've maybe got a squad of 22, 23 two or three of them aren't even getting stripped. That isn't enjoyable, you know, at part-time level. Of course, you want to win, you want to be successful, but the players have to enjoy coming to their work because it's not their main job, it's their secondary job. So I think all of these things, so I would like to have a squad of 18 or 19 players where you've maybe got seven, eight, nine players that can play in more than one position um, and try and run with a smaller squad. Uh, and finally, Gary, have you got a message for the fans for the upcoming season ahead? Just really to continue the support that they've shown myself and Brown since we've came to the club. Uh, they got right behind the team, even in the difficult moments. They showed great support to the players. We're trying to be successful. We're trying to build something successful. And we want the fans to try and buy into that. Obviously, what we can do is we need to try and be successful on the pitch. We need to get good performances, good results. And I'm sure if we do that, the fans will come along and support us. But that's what we need to do. And I'm sure if we all get together and, we, and we're a, as a one, then I'm hoping it's going to be a successful season. Brilliant, Gary. Thanks for your time. Cheers. Cheers.